computer and today I'm going to show you an industrial themed unit and how our PEG proposals work. So if you're interested to inquire and ask about our services, I'm going to show you one of the things that we do to propose a design for a space. So the first one is called a 3D model. That's when we draw an exact model of your unit and spec proposal where we show you photos and discuss the direction of the space. So that's what we did for this unit. This unit is actually a two bedroom unit that we changed into a spacious one bedroom unit. We took out the second bedroom and the maid's room to create an expanded living room and bar counter. In my proposals, I show my clients photos of what their space would look like, the direction, the theme, and apply it into the space. For example, in the living room, we would have this wood accent for the TV wall and exposed pin light. So that's what we did in the space. We also showed her that she could have a polished concrete flooring for that real industrial effect. The client likes entertaining guests, hence the large sofa and long bar counter. It also has a work area as a TV wall. For the kitchen, we wanted a cabinet design that is seamless with appliances built in. We use gloss concrete laminate, black matte laminate, metallic backsplash, and black granite. It is a fully functional kitchen with built-in oven and microwave, stove and range hood, sink, and the refrigerator is right next to the wine rack. Also near the refrigerator is the laundry area. This space is actually the maid's bathroom, which we have turned into a storage and laundry room. Going to the bedroom area, you will notice the shoe cabinet at the back of the sofa that also acts as a console table that can house displays and picture frames. Opposite the living area is a tiny bedroom and walk-in closet enclosed in a glass wall divider. The bed has drawers and the headboard is secret storages. Right next to the bedroom is the walk-in closet and like in our classic modern video, this also has a pull-out vanity and accessories for and finally, in the bathroom, I showed the client that it would have great tiles. But during construction, I realized that it was having too much um, gray color and it was too dim. So I wanted the bathroom to have a more lively color. So I made it into this colorful bathroom. So that's it for this industrial themed unit. Let me know in the comments what you think. And thank you so much guys for watching. And don't forget to like my page, Making It Happen, and Madhouse Design Studio. If you're interested in our interior design and construction services, email us at madhousedesignstudio at gmail.com. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you next time. Bye!